Good evening and welcome. Here we are. Friday evening in good company, I hope. Ah, so satisfactory it is. Could be uh, my last my last satisfactory in this week, obviously. But um, I'm also not going to be able to stream on Monday, so next time will be Wednesday. So if we get a crowd going and we get um, sort of the ball rolling, then we might uh, run a bit later today. Just to keep sort of... Uh, content flowing on YouTube. So, how are you all feeling? Having a good work week ending, hopefully. And time for some relaxation. As usual, I'm starting with a... Uh... <laughs> Who woke me? Hmm. Stressful work week for sure. Oh, I feel sorry for you then. What? Robin, your headache is soon gone by now. Woke up with a headache today. Oh, that sucks. Um, maybe drink some water. I know it's it's like this silly thing, but and it doesn't really help when you have a headache, but it will kind of make it subside. I think it, at least for me, usually when I get a headache, uh, unless it's corporate politics related and it isn't these days, then it's almost certainly lack of sleep, lack of water. Just saying. Then again, consult your physician, all that. Um, uh, Hapot is never in Discord. He's always invisible in Discord. So, what do we have here? We don't know. I don't know. Let's have a look. We have... Yeah, it would have been nice if they fixed this. Uh, this is build number 100,979. That's definitely a higher number than last time. So, let's actually have a look at this Mark IV belt. Just to confirm that we are on the new version. Uh, 480, yes. And do you guys, if, if you were here on Wednesday, you would have noticed that I had designed the entire thing towards this belt consuming 480. You guessed it. Um, so I designed against 480, knowing full well that it would be, uh, it would be, um, running out, it would never be able to saturate the last thing. And then lo and behold, it turns out that uh, my predictions, they were left to look at, oh, you know, that's such a great design. Let's let's make sure it uh, it fits with Mr. Ninos and his builds. I'm sure that uh, that's how it goes. Uh, but the thing is, I think it's a great move because 480 is a great number. 450, not so much. What? Goddamn stupid trees, what the hell? They, I can guarantee you, these, uh, these, this is the snake leg trees, they call them, right? They are not supposed to be here. They respawned. Kill them all. Oh, there's going to be a lot of... Oh, by the way, there was something about a, an elite stinger in the red forest. And <laughs> we went to the red forest. So, I actually want to kind of go there and up there and increase the throughput so we can get more out so that means um, I got a few shots but not really a lot not enough let's get up here you have only one container of bullets ah, I have 40 shots that's plenty to kill whatever elites are out there I know it isn't but let's um let's pretend and let's at least go out there and then figure out how bad it is. Now that's annoying, that one. I have to take that from the other side. Because that's... Ugh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, clipping, clipping, clipping. Let's not do that. Let's do this and pretend that it's okay. This is um, quite a climb. And there we go. Can I do this? I can, but it was probably not a particularly good idea. So, yep. You know, I actually should do... I don't know. I don't know how dangerous they are, but if they are any kind of dangerous, then... We really should be, whoops, paying attention. We 
you see anything? I'm gonna crank up the sound here. So I really get scared if they come in. See, this one, yoink. That should be to it, 480. Yep, yeah, cool. And look at this. It's now the center of, it's no longer the center. Ooh, okay, that's pretty loud. Okay, um, I don't see anything. And I certainly don't need anything either. So we'll just keep this as it is. Those elite stingers, I'm worried about them because I'm not good friends with those. Okay, so let's... Uh, oh, whoa, 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 that's not it. Uh, the quartz. Yeah. I think this way we can go to the quartz. Oh, this is... Not risky at all, is it? Oh no 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 no! That's. I don't know what the hell I was doing. It was completely the wrong direction. Wow! All right, let's not do that. I was just like, yeah, I'll just jump out. That's fine. Except, nope, nope, not at all. I don't want to pay for my own subs. I want you to pay for the subs. I don't want my, to pay my own subs. It sucks. Ending. There it is. Uh, yeah, they reworked the fog, and that sucks. It's kind of dense, to be honest. A bit too dense, I would say. Okay, come figure this. This is now 225. If we do that thing, it'll be 240, and I'll do the same for this one. Two forty. Good stuff. And this is a transport belt, so I'll fly off. I like it. Oh, look at this. The frame rate is actually quite okay. They must have done some optimization. Okay, that bouncy gun there is... They've definitely done the optimization. This is so nice to see. Wow. Good morning, JD. This is nice. I can look at my factory again. Yeah, it's starting to come together, but you can hopefully also see why I need to um, to build something bigger. Uh, why I need to finish up some of the aesthetic parts of it. We really need some colors as well. And fly! Awesome. It's nice, it was about, uh, okay, I don't want to be sound odd, but I think it was about time they started adding some optimization because they will see how much people will are straining it and, whoops, so. There, there comes a time when it makes sense to start looking at optimization. I think they've reached that point. Why is this not connected? I think we forgot Vichu here. Yeah, Vichu was near, not here. Yeah. Damn it. No, it is there. The Vichu must have been here when we did this. It just didn't look like it. There. No, no, no. It, it's me going oops because I was... Um... Is this one? No, it's this one that wasn't working. Uh, okay, well, still... Whoops. <clears throat> still, still this one. You are not invited. <laughs> More crap? Probably.
And so does the good old trusty chainsaw. The beacon of happiness. Beacon of happiness. Gotta love the beacon of happiness. Alright, we got this one up. I could not imagine that such a small thing would bring so much joy. There, <laughs> we're less than 1k. Alright, so this is what we built last time, and this is what kind of where we got stuck. Oops. Yay, it's finally at the top corner again. Much nicer. Uh, not get, not even got stuck, but this is just what we built last time and just as an indicator for what the hell we were going to do. Oh yeah, I, I did have some good thoughts about it. So, this one is... Oh, did this... This seemed to change, didn't it? It used to be five wide. I don't understand why they didn't put in some icons here. That, that seems like something you would be like, get some icons in there. You know what they did back in the... Back in the early WoW days, the lead art designer who was responsible for it, anything that didn't have an icon got his face in it. It was so funny, like five, six years later, you could still find very, very like secret debuffs that didn't have any icon and you could sort of get them in there and then they had his face on there. That's uh, that's something you should do, like, yeah, there you go. That's a picture of Jace, <laughs> especially with, um, with the Instagram filter thing on it. That would be hilarious. Subscriber, come steal yourself. We are building an army. Um, there, yeah, I'm slow at typing my own. Uh, thank you, Maverly, for the three months of subscription. I just had to get those. Uh, sorry, come steal yourself. We are building an army. And Smeagol for the five months. Awesome. I was so hoping that it would work. Uh, a new subscriber. Come steal yourself. We are building uh, oh, an right, army. Nick too as well. Missed you as well. Awesome. Resubbing, resubbing with Twitch Prime. So resubbing is let's uh see if anyone else has uh, missed their sub. However, I really appreciate you did this because because I really appreciate you did it. The other thing is, I have been struggling to get my get these sorted. Um, let's see the alerts. Where the hell are the alerts? There we go. Alert box. <sighs> I built this one. Subscriptions under the alert variations under the resub for at least two months should go. Welcome back. Your steadfast loyalty is greatly appreciated. But it seems it does not register as a resub for two months. It registers as a... As a Twitch Prime, which goes like this. A new subscriber. Yeah. Come, steal yourself. We are building an army. Hmm. So it doesn't seem like I can trigger the other ones for some reason. A new subscriber. Come, steal yourself. We are building an army. Thank you, Paul66766. This is awesome. Really appreciate it. It's, I can't trigger. I mean, if if someone is both a Twitch Prime and resubbing for three months, then which one of those should it be triggering the Twitch Prime notification or should it be triggering the... Um, the three months sort of notification and it seems it always triggers the Twitch Prime sort of notification. I don't know, but um, I'm gonna keep testing it, but not right now. A new subscriber. See, this is a brand Come new subscriber. This is awesome. We are building an army. Hey, I guess uh, people have been really chucking up on their Twitch Prime. Thank you very much, Anguish Bacon, and welcome to the Order of the Path. Thank you very much for supporting. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate. It. I really do. It. It's subs are just uh, the bread and butter of making this uh, crazy thing go alive or c come alive. So thank you and welcome. Hope you enjoy your stay here.
and we'll have many awesome anniversaries. Ah, look, it slides. It is different. I don't like it. I'm sorry. See, I don't like that they're not the same width. The fact that the whole menu here changes size when you do this, that, that doesn't seem right. Because that means... If you're clicking here, it A doesn't go endowment. the other way. Hey, Virtue! Thank you! Look at the weed leaderboard! Leaderboard! Yay! It's awesome! It is exactly... Uh, it's awesome, that leaderboard. That is crazy. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's very, uh, very generous of you. So, let's see. Aluminium ingots here. A kind gesture. Miguel, thank you for the 300 bits. Let's buy some Roboport. Oh, wait. Wrong, wrong game. <laughs> let's... Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Right, so I get 15 aluminium ingots inbound. Let's see, we have 240 aluminium ingots produced downstairs. Let's confirm just to, just to make sure. That goes into this one. This is 30, one, two, three, four. That's 120 plus 120, so it's 240. And that goes out into two lanes. Yeah. So this one goes in. That one, this is 120. And 120 can be... 1, 2, 3, 4 times 2. So this one can feed this entire floor. And the next floor up will also be uh, taken by this one. Cool. So I guess this is going to be at ground level. And then we have the copper at the end going at bit higher level. That seems good. That seems very good. Shagood. Indeed. Maybe. It looks right. And we have all the space in the world, right? All the space in the world. This one. Oh, hold on. Do we though? Do we? That's the merger. Which way is the merger going? I don't know. Should it go this way? I think if we go this way, we are... Yeah, 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 we can do that. We'll just go above here. Out. Let's do that. Is that correct? No, it's not. One... Two, like this. Good. And uh, you know what? I have to take this merge out because I don't know if, which way it's turning. It needs to go towards me. Towards me. goes out somewhere somehow out here and this one is also going to be a merge way outwards this will be copper processing going out here and that will have to be getting upwards right have you happened to have found made any batteries yet i found some batteries yeah I don't think, can you make batteries? I don't think you can make batteries yet. Hello, Modex. Welcome. Batteries? I don't think they're used for anything, but I don't, I don't know. The, <clears throat> this one? Here. Clipping, you say? Okay, then I'm gonna take these out. And, oh, right, there is a point to this. The point was, this has to fit, which means that's not gonna happen. Which means this one's not gonna happen. It's gonna be closer because it's awesome when it's closer. 
Let's try this one. Let's try another one. Of awesome, not awful, awesome. And that means this one will be the same location because why not? Otherwise, it'll go insane. And that will go from out here and whoops, there, right? Yes. This is one that comes in here and it goes. Got it. Oh, this, look at this, it's placing it in the middle. <laughs> it's really not how it should be. I love that they're stackable. I love that it's interesting that they said in the patch note, and they're stackable, but maybe they were already stackable. I was like, wow, I guess you have full control of what goes into each patch. Yeah, this new feature, unless we release the new feature before, we don't really know. And by any means, um, if anyone is not understanding what the hell we're doing, just ask, because I'm kind of continuing from where we left off last time, and if that doesn't make any sense, then just speak up. This is, after all, new stuff we're building. And maybe your question that you may seem are uh, stupid will actually reveal that oh I forgot that you need copper to be processed to be smelted before shoving it into machines that's like a hypothetical example that would never happen in in real life but you know you get the gist of it good so this one is one two Yep. Now if only Linus had a copy paste he could duplicate the inputs over and over. Yep, if only. But alas, oh this one's actually not going to be here because uh, we have decided not to do it that way. Let's get this one. Although I must say, I do very much enjoy placing belts. I don't know. I don't enjoy placing power balls, but I do enjoy placing belts. That is very enjoyable somehow. I don't know why, but it is. So we now need this one to go... Got it? Um, they did fix the consumption or was very high when I used them last. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. What are we talking about? Okay. Um, I feel crude oil and batteries, not to forget converted slug thingies as fuel for one single vehicle. Wow. You can use batteries as vehicle? Nice. 11 messages deleted by moderator. Well done, Mr. Spammer. No pit paid no pictures of uh, of spiders here. Listen the copper on two lines so that you don't have to connect them. Yes, serious yes. Exactly. Okay. It was a cat pick. Yeah, 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 yeah. You and your cat picks. The floating cubes look so bad. What floating cubes? These? They're not floating. They're connected. They're connected right there. Go there. And then they're connected down here. This is... These don't weigh very much. They're just... 
bare metal. But one elevator lift is missing. Really? One elevator lift is missing. What the hell are you talking about? One elevator lift. Oh, you're looking. You're looking right at it. Except I'm not looking at it because it doesn't exist. Right, that one. Okay, cool. Thanks. There we go. Now it's safe. Good morning, tall man. It's not morning for you. It's not morning for us either. Thank you. Now this one. Now this is also, let's call it, interesting. <laughs> I wonder why that happened. Hey, look! I've actually decided to do exactly the same two times now. By sheer coincidence. So I built this one last time and now I built exactly the same on the side. Let's see how much exact it's exactly exactly the same. That's awesome. I love exactly exactly the same. Nice. So this one comes from here. And this is the copper. Don't you have a second input for silica as well? Yes, I do. Uh, not silica. Um, at the ground floor, I produce two times 120. This floor here only consumes 120. So I'm going to have to replicate this floor two times. And I'm only going to build it once. But when we need more, I'm going to build one more. And that will make it consume all of it. So I'm currently only consuming half of what I need to. Still no nuclear stuff. No, still no nuclear stuff. I can't do nuclear unless I have aluminium first. And aluminium, I don't do hacks, as you are well aware. So I'm going to have to build this properly, which is also just fine, because I like it. I don't... I want to build the nuclear, absolutely, no doubt about it. But I also... When I build the nuclear, that's pretty much going to be the end of it. Until the trains come in. Which we still don't know when when they're coming in so not really any any panic or anything I'm gonna have all summer to get this done so it'll get there don't you worry Nah, let's not do it that way. One, two. And this is going to be the aluminium ore. Or uh, aluminium ingots. going to be the copper ore. That's also working. I think we got all the belts except we need the copper coming in. Now the copper inbound is going to be a bit of a tricky thing because either we get it in on two belts or we get it in one belt and then it goes out again i think we get it in as one belt and then get it out again which means is it possible to do this uh let's see if it was aligned of course Trains are coming soon. Oh, really? You don't say soon? Oh, let me hold my breath for that. Besides that, I would imagine that trains would need a lot of aluminium. So 
we're gonna need that anyway we do also need to build the turbo motors i'm pretty sure we would need turbo motors for this uh is that the outbound well that's not gonna work is it it is but it's not as pretty as it could have been i actually want this one over here nope it's gonna be a merger like this inbound no, it's a splitter, you idiot. How to save? One, two. There. So basically, it comes in here and then it goes out and further up for the rest of it because this can easily support both did I miss that? I think I didn't did I? Ugh. I have such a bad tendency to build splitters when it, they're not splitting. Just like it for consistency sake. All right, there we go. Good evening, Mr. Timoney. Ah, there's no invisible beer yet. Nope, no invisible beer yet. Never do the invisible beer on before the first break. And I think I've set up the breaks this time. Yeah, I think so. Cheers, everyone, and sort of soft drinks. Um, all right, let's let's actually mention something else. Tomorrow, there was a bit of talk of me and Hub continuing with the Borderlands, but ultimately no one was, no one said, yay, awesome. So we're like, okay, whatever. And I found it fun, but also extremely exhausting. Um, and that's, as you can probably tell, I don't like oops, my streams to be exhausting. I like them to be chilling. Chilling not as in cold, but chilling as in chillaxing. Ugh, awful word, by the way. Um, oh, this one's not done yet. So I'm going to try something else tomorrow. And if you look in my schedule, it's going to be something very different. I hope that it's going to be a crazy fun laugh it's gonna be Trova saves the universe basically Rick and Morty uh, game it's gonna be obscenely obscene language and I expect that we'll there'll be a fair amount of invisibility involved this seems like the perfect opportunity to just go all out it I looked something of this and I was just if you like Rick and Morty and yeah what immature guy on the internet doesn't like uh, Rick and Morty, then it's pretty much the same kind of really, really, really inappropriate humor all the way through in a game. So I think that's going to be fun. I'm, uh, I'm really looking forward to it. Unfortunately, I did not announce it enough in advance, but I think it's, uh, it's going to be fun. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm really looking forward to trying it. So. So yeah, Trova saves the world, saves the universe even, not just the world, the entire universe. I don't like Rick and Morty. Never seen Rick and Morty. God damn, you guys are... Okay, it's... Let me... I'm not particularly... I'm not the biggest fan of Rick and Morty, but um, it, it kind of grows old. It's kind of... Let me try to explain this in the most succinct way. It is our decades Beavis and Butthead, which is not a good a good thing, by the way. Um, Beavis and Butthead was like ah oh, the appeal of everyone, except Rick and Morty has this sprinkling of nerdy humor just to make you uh, seem like an intellectual because you, you if you like uh, Rick and Morty. That was not a good advertising for it but it's kind of the humor is 
yeah, making South Park look tame, and which is interesting in and of itself. And I think it's going to be just a just a fun, casual thing to to do. And you know what? That should not be there. for it. So anyway, it's just going to be a casual game uh, that's just going to be fun. I hope we can have a lot of laughs and maybe drink a few beers and just have a good old time. Why is nothing how powered? Okay, this is powered. It just doesn't have a recipe then. That must be it. You have a recipe. Why are you? Oh, you're just blinking yellow. So that's fine. It's actually working. Glad. Uh, I guess we also have the kind of the issue here on storage. It's anti-symmetric. Of course, it's anti-symmetric. They are not uh, mirrored. I don't know it's anti-symmetric, it's just not symmetric. And I wouldn't call it anti-symmetric. But I guess you would. Did these get copper? Oh yeah. Copper and the other ones, do they? No, they're red, so they probably don't have the copper recipe yet. Correct. Oh no, there we go. So that's fine. The one thing that isn't fine is actually this one. Now here comes another little issue. Uh, we are going to build a storage location, like this. I guess this one has to go one more up, because it has to go above the next one. Did they? No, they didn't fix, the, fix that yet. One, two. Does that work? Oh yeah. Tripping the rift. All episodes are free on YouTube. 35 laughs and bad humor. Um, JD, can I ask you to tag me on uh, Discord with that? Because it, it sounds good, but um, there's no way I can remember it. As much as I'd like to, there's just no way. One, two. Hey, that's fortunate. We can just put it here. And then we can bring it out and either into this one or that one. And maybe we can even take this one, goes out to two. This, and then the other one could do be exactly the same, except go into that one. And then we'll have two lanes go down. It's just weed. All right, it's all good. Everything is hooked up. All we need is love. Uh, what? No. Aluminium ingots. That's all we need. There we go. That's going to be awesome. We did build somewhere over here. Uh, what color should aluminium be? That should actually be white. White-ish, right? Like silver would be ideal, but it's kind of difficult to make a silver colored in this this game so there we have our copper we're gonna have to find a way to get it in here now we can leech one of those underneath here because they're coming in for this location so let's do that and this one is going to now that's the usual thing of me just now what what the hell am I gonna do anyway I'm just gonna do it that way and we can figure out where to afterwards. But let's see. The lower one here. Yeah? 
The lower one is quartz, so this is already occupied. We can take this one because it's not going to collide. I could not imagine to doing that, but it actually will never collide. So we can take the same one as this has quartz, just to make sure we don't do much of it. And that one, here. And now that goes out, out, and well, well, well. So we meet again. It was actually okay, except it wasn't, but that's fine. Hmm. Well, that's easy. Copper input is coming here. the conveyor belt decide to be too long here because that's uh i'm doing it from the wrong side am i not oh wouldn't it be fun if they changed the max length this we we set this what if they change the max length in just a random patch do not watch with kids uh, i don't watch the random things just with kids <laughs> i do try to ah the most horrible thing we're reading now Kids love what love Narnia, so we re, we are reading the Narnia trilogy, septology, whatever hell it is. Oh my god, that's such a piece of shit novel. My god, that's bad. I and imagine that C.S. Lewis and Tolkien were best buddies and reading for each other. Tolkien must have been like, "What the hell kind of crap is that shit? Take it out. Stop preaching your Jesus lion here. It's absolute shit." Like, oh, the only thing, the only way you can solve things is to, through battle. You must, you must go to war. Which is kind of also a theme in, in Tolkien, but, but that's probably a product of their time. That the only way that you could solve things was through the world wars. Uh -huh. Anyway, but it's like they build a massive conflict and then people die and get slaughtered everywhere. And then the Jesus line comes in and goes, poof, it's all great. Like, why the hell did you not do that before? If you're going to come in and save the day, why do you wait until thousands are killed and monsters are rampant all over the all over the, the kingdom? And then come in and roar and everyone lays down their weapons. What? Why? Yeah, okay. I'm I'm really angry at at those kind of uh, those kind of things. Like, yeah. And it doesn't have to be well, it's the least objectionable Christianity pushing children book, at least. I don't know. I wouldn't call it the least objectionable. I don't know. You must have read some really bad shit. What? A rare case of Invisini Love spotted. What? Invisini Love? Ah! Oh, yeah, by the way, if you look at my face and think, mm, the colors are not right, isn't he a bit pink? That's unfortunately not the light. That's me actually going outside for a bit and and just turning pink by just hitting being hit by sunlight. It's it was it was awful. Would not recommend. No, it was good, but yeah, I'm I'm not really just like. Ta da! Sun is your enemy. Yo, it is it is it is indeed. What are we building? What did I miss? You missed the L-clad aluminium thingy thingy thingy, yeah? Why is it so slow? It's kind of pathetic. Something is wrong here. I think that someone has been... Uh, no, drinking the Kool-Aid here. What the hell? You, you built properly. Don't build this crap. Who the hell said that you could build this crap? No. We don't do this here. If we do things, we do things seriously. If I don't do this, if I don't consume the power, then there's really no point in me building nuclear power. So, oh yeah, please. Double the speed. Thank you very much. Uh, be careful of the UV rays. At the moment they are harmful oh they're especially harmful to someone like me but the thing is i am 
very nationalist. Then you're like, what? He said he was very nationalist. Oh, I absolutely am. I am the epitome of the Danish flag. I turn red and white, just alternating those colors. It's how a true Dane should behave in the sun. And then I turn pink or red. And then uh, a couple of days later, I'm back to white again. Pink doesn't have without three to five hours of exposure. Well, it happens a lot less. <laughs> White headphones on a pink. I said, yeah. <laughs> Look, the Danish flag. <laughs> uh, well, it, it could also be uh, it could also be a tribute to our um, to our Greenlandic friends, colonies. Don't think we're allowed to say that. Colonists. Um, because it's the national day of uh, of Greenland, which is kind of silly. Can you have a national day if you're not a separate nation? Oh, let's not go there because then I'll be lynched by uh, all the drunk Greenland people. Yeah, we do have our own issues with our colonialism in Denmark. So uh, that's uh, like all <laughs> like all uh, nations that used to have colonies and have a kind of a strained relationship to uh, to the re how they work right now. Yeah. <laughs> ah, there you go. Um, that's it. We got all the... Well, not all, but this is actually producing way faster than the encased industrial beams, so we might just start just throwing them everywhere. Hmm. So what I want to do is actually make sure that we do things properly with this tower. We can choose the color, but we have to choose one of the existing colors. So, we're not campaigning with the chainsaw. That's just not happening today. So we had one shot left. One shot, one kill. This is as much color as we can put. We can't even remove it. All right, let's see. Um, can I see any yellow flowers around here? Because I don't bother going all the way back. I don't know if I would be able to see. Yeah, one shot, one opportunity. <laughs> yep. Don't you need more stuff to make Mark 4 belts? I don't think so. No? Missing alclad aluminium sheets. No, no we do have plenty of those. Uh, you know what, maybe we should take some and make our gargoyles. Ding, 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 ding. That's sweet, 400. There is a statement about no handcraft. Ah! What the hell? No handcrafting of things that I have a tower already building. I do not have a flower tower, which would be an interesting title. This floor is left deliberately empty, like the uh, that page in a book where it says this page is left deliberately empty. It's like, what? it's not empty. You wrote on it, so. There, there, there. Luckily that blinking thing for the color gun is not going to be annoying anytime soon. Okay, now it even pisses me off. Damn. You got me before I got you. Let's see, positive and academical. Didn't you say last time one of the belts in the lower tower designed 480 towers per minute? You should upgrade that belt first. No, I shouldn't, positively academical, because they decided between Wednesday and today to upgrade the speed of Mark IV belts to 480, which means my, my design is 100% awesomely designed towards the, the, uh, the change that was announced the day after I designed it. I'm just saying, I got connections. But thank you for letting me, <laughs> letting me, yeah, revel at revel at that uh, that fact. 
¿Sí? Ta-da! 480. And this is 780. So now it's actually the same speed as a yellow belt. 3, 4, 5, 6. And of course by yellow belt I mean half a yellow belt. Doesn't that mean that, that every building in 450 belts are wrong? No, why would it mean that? I don't see why that would uh, have any impact. If I designed it towards 450, it's just going to consume the 450. That doesn't mean it's... Even though it could consume more, it doesn't mean that it has to consume more. Our modest fellowship expands. Oh yeah. Praise the sun. See, that was a normal one. Yeah, it works. It works. Okay, something is working. All right, this one triggered... It was not the same one as, as the other one, because this is a normal sub. Yippee, yay, something working. Thank you, Coomber. Three months, that's very nice. And thank you for supporting me for three months running. And also for helping me test the announcement, the different types of announcement. It still doesn't work with those uh, resub messages for whatever reason. Need more testing. Unfortunately, it can do one test for each stream because I'll set up, I'll change change something, then we'll let it sit there, and then we'll figure out if uh, if it works. Let's do it on this side as well. JD, what did you do and what did I miss? I don't know, since when? Two, three, four, five, six. We are counting to six. If that is unfamiliar to people, then you will have another opportunity to learn it today. Counting to six calculator. What was the test? Hmm? Uh, we need to, we need a resub of a not prime sub quickly, but that's what we got here. The uh, Kumba was a, uh, was exactly that. Unfortunately, it doesn't work. Uh, JD, it's the... I've set up Streamlab variations. I set up one up for a sub of... Uh, a One for a sub of... Like a regular sub, one for a Twitch Prime sub, one for a resub for two months, and one for a resub for six months. So... Except I cannot make it trigger the resubs because it will always trigger the other ones. Power pole at floor level missing. Nope, it's not missing. It's omitted. Because this level is not going to be built. This will be the the roof. Hence, I don't need it. Or not just I don't need it. I, I don't want it. It doesn't serve a purpose. And I don't have it here either. It goes up. But thank you. There shouldn't be too much uh, like this placement of, uh, of these kind of things today. I know we've had our fair share of this last time. So we are pretty much done with this tower. It's just back here and back again. We're gonna build some roofs. That's just the way it is. Still not anywhere near running out of these. There we go. And now I can change this one. Oh, look at 
look at that. Zzzz, zzzz, zzzz. <laughs> More mistakes than him, I'm not even playing. No, 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 you're not making mistakes. I, there's, you are catching things that seem illogical and sometimes my illogical behavior is deliberate. And then I'll just point it out. Our modest fellowship expands. Praise the sub. Yes, indeed. Praise the sub. Wooden. Woden? I would call you wooden, but you're not wooden. Woden, thank you very much for the three months of in a row. Thank you for your subscription. What dimensions are the four floors? They are 10 by 9. Seems like an illogical size, but I'm actually really happy with this size. And all of the towers are 9 by 10. There is no exceptions. We don't talk about it. First rule of Satisfactory City, we do not talk about the the size of the towers that are not... The, uh, the official size of the towers is 10 by 9. And that's my story, and I'm going to stick with it. And I will have nothing else. So now we're just making the roof, because it's very important. Players in the way. Most obnoxious warning. There's an easier way to do this because I don't think this is particularly easy. I think I switch too often between. Build it like completed it from this side. Does that make it easier? build them from this side and just drag them over. Might be. Be a hole in there. And that means we can drag these. That's I think that's slightly easier. Don't don't run me out of business here. 119. Okay. Did I set a beacon there? No, I did not, but I'm gonna set it up. Uh you know what? That's actually a good idea. Let's set the beacon in the middle-ish. I don't know, like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's one. Yep, there. Beacon. Going. L clad at 
120 alclad aluminium sheet. We don't know what color yet, so we'll have to come back for that at some point. Oh yes, solar on the roof would be really nice actually. Oh. And now comes the next part, and that's uh, actually... Oh, I missed it. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I know, we are... I'm missing a bad break, I know, I know, but I just... One, two, three, four. I know I'm missing my break. Sorry. That one, it's important. Now we build... Come on, you gotta be making it. Come on, you could do it. No! Stupid oscillators. And beacons and stuff. Alright. Screw it. We're gonna build that after the break. I was just hoping we could just get this tower completely completed. We're gonna just jump here and take a look at this beautiful thing. Hey, Thoso. Sorry, missed you. And, and missed your reading in my sort of frantic effort to try to make it before the break. I don't want that red one to be on the picture. There we go. And boom. I'm going to take a short three minute break. Then I'm going to come back, obviously. And I'm going to pick, come back with an Invisibear because it's Friday evening. So if you feel like joining me for that, be my guest. I'll see you guys in three minutes. <laughs> 